our election, Senator Dr. Ifa Okowa came up with what I call today as the marketing scheme, which is the smart agenda. And the number one on that agenda is strategic wealth creation through job creation. And what are we doing today? We are giving vent to that particular number one item in the five point agenda for Nip Smart to strategically make money available to the people, not by girls giving them money, but teaching them how to fish and eventually making them to become fishermen. And not that we have to go to the river and bring out the fish and give to them to showcase that they have fish in their hands. What we are also doing today, we also underlines and possibly underscores what we have said that up to the 28th of May 2023 that we will continue to work. And you can see that even with just few weeks to the end of our administration, we are still empowering deltans. I must appreciate the Ministry of Youth Development. They have come up with a whole number of uh, innovations to enable us manage the youth. You can see the peace we enjoy today in Delta. You can trace it to these different entrepreneurial programs and the policies of this administration aimed at ensuring that troubled minds are brought to where they become minds that are settled. So it is not by magic or by accident that you are seeing a whole lot of peace in Delta. We have taken pain to reach out to our people. These number of students, they go out, they testify. So even those who have not reached out to, because of course, you know, we couldn't pride ourselves that we have done everything that, you, that needed to be done. But have we left the shore? Yes, we have. And our ship is sailing very, very smoothly. The good thing is that we are now having a man who have won election, Sheriff Uburowori, who is going to continue from where we stop and do more. We trust that he has promised that he's going to do more. We believe that he has got the ability to do more because he has been a parcel and parcel of this administration and understand the need to engage the people. And so we congratulate those of them who are fortunate today to have received these starter packs. We also do know that with Sheriff coming on board, that they will not be the last of these persons who will also benefit from this program. And that is the beautiful thing about the election that took place on the 18th of uh, April, on the 18th of, 18th of March this year. So we are happy and we urge all those who have benefited today to take a look at those who have benefited in other programs in time past to see how they become great entrepreneurs. We have those who have even trained more than 100 persons. Not only trained 100 persons, they have also gone ahead to employ more than 15 persons in their workplace. So who says they are not they are not great entrepreneurs? These persons you are seeing today, before they even go for their NYIC, would have also ended up becoming great entrepreneurs. So they are not going to be busy taking their bag and their CVs, moving from one office to the other, claiming that they are seeking for job because other people will come to them to seek for that job, which ordinarily they would have been the ones seeking. So they are already made, and we must appreciate the state government for this initiative.